What's up guys? Welcome back to another episode of the Griffin series here on The Herd and we are back in Griffin, Indiana. Our last day this week that we are going to fully devote our time to this series. We have moved quite a distance in just a week. We've got a couple production facilities that are working right now. We will, I hope, get some more sheep very soon and we are getting all of this silage baled up right now that's what we're doing today we're going to bale it up then we're going to wrap it up let it ferment and make some money and we're going to need it because we're about a million dollars in debt now, of course, the million dollars is the doom and the gloom situation, but on the other side of that coin is that we're gonna be making a lot of money very, very soon. We have got some clothes that are being done by the tailor. We have got a lot of wool that is being produced by our sheep, and we're gonna get more sheep, which means that there's going to be even more wool. So we're going to get out of this debt pretty close uh, to, I think, about the end of year three. That's what I'm hoping. That's the goal. Now, just for a quick update for those who have just joined the series, we are in Griffin, Indiana. We have created a clothing company, and this is year two right now. Year one, we were just cutting grass like we're doing now, making enough money so that we could actually grow this thing. We got some sheep in year one as well, but now in year two, we are focused on more tailors, on more spinneries, and more production, and more production meaning more sheep. Now, just to put it to rest, the inside joke here on this channel is that we were going to get a warehouse and we never did and we kept putting it off. And now we are going to completely terminate that plan because I think that if we get the spinneries mo moving the way they are and we're able to keep up with the wool, we won't really need a place to store them outside of the spinnery. So it's gonna save us a little bit, bit of money and if we were gonna buy something that expensive like a warehouse, we should just add another spinnery. That's the whole point. Now, if you were here for the last episode, we worked 14 hours on mowing and baling and all of that in between. And we still have a couple hours left in the morning here that we have to bale. That's how big our fields are. And I'm not even mentioning that we have a field that we haven't even mowed yet. So we've got tons of grass, tons of silage, and tons of opportunity to make money. And that is exactly what we're going to do here on the second cutting. What we're doing now, we're going to wrap all these bales, we're going to let them ferment into silage, and then we're going to bring them to our good friends down at the Griffin Livestock Yard. That's the whole plan. That's how we make some more money. And that's how we get out of all of this debt. Now approaching one o'clock and the house side already done, everything is already wrapped up and fermenting right now. We are over here in the production field and we are getting more things wrapped up. Next is going to be that big field over there and it's gonna take a long time. Are we gonna be able to wrap all of this up? No, no we're not. But I would like to at least get a quarter of the big field done. That's a realistic goal, I think. Okay, now 2.30 and the house side, done. The production side, done. And we'll call this the sheep side and we'll also call this nowhere close to done. We are not going to get done with this field today, as I said, but it is really exciting that we're wrapping so many bales because the livestock yard is going to be packed to the brim. And so is our bank account, hopefully. We're gonna be able to pay off a little bit more of these loans and buy a little bit more production facilities. But like I said, the next thing, is more sheep and now quarter after five and as you can see we have got a lot of bales out there half of them are wrapped up and already fermenting into silage the other half are either going to be done in the next hour or they are going to have to wait until tomorrow because that is when i'm going to have to stop but this is where i'm going to stop the video right now guys thank you so much for watching thanks for hanging out with me today and i will catch you in the next one